based on the allegations and the criminal threats made in this nine page complaint and some of the behavior that I even witnessed myself earlier today in that uh, sixth floor courtroom, Judge James E. Gates decided that Kevin Douglas is to undergo a mental health evaluation to even see if he is fit for trial. In court today, as no cell phones, no cameras were even allowed, Douglas appeared to be visibly annoyed with what he was going through today at times, becoming impatient with his lawyer who began court asking for a continuance so she could have more time to review his file and the complaints against him. And in that complaint, numerous threats made to the Bright Horizons daycare that was across the street from the Cary Extended Stay Hotel, where he had been described as being a long term resident. Today was supposed to be a day for Douglas to undergo a preliminary hearing and detention hearing to go over the charges against him and determine if he was to remain in custody. Douglas could be heard and even seen talking to himself at times during court and at one point referred to the proceedings as, quote, an obstruction of justice. Now, the next step is for Douglas to undergo a mental health evaluation, uh, which is something his attorney argued that she would like to see happen within the next 30 days or so. This is a developing story that we are continuing to follow. And once that happens, Judge Gates will then determine what the next course of action is for Kevin Douglas. We'll continue to stay on this as it develops. We're live in Raleigh tonight. Dwan Hogarth, NBC 11 Eyewitness News.